Libraries in Illinois are facing more pressure to take certain books some people don't agree with off the shelves. The American Library Association reports there were 67 attempts to ban books in 2022. That's up from 41 the year before that. But a bill in the Capitol wants to make sure libraries don't ban books or they might not get state money. State Capitol reporter Theodore Kulvaris live in our Capitol newsroom. Theodore, what exactly type of books do they want to ban? Well, Brendan, lawmakers say some people are wanting to ban books whose content people don't agree with or for political reasons. But one lawmaker supporting the bill says if this bill passes, it will make sure books don't come off the shelves. In libraries, you can find a wide range of books from nonfiction to cookbooks. But some libraries are facing pressure to ban ones people consider controversial. Banning books was once the most repugnant thing you could do in the 21st century. Now it's being considered on a regular basis. A bill in the Capitol would make sure libraries keep books on the shelves. Under the proposal, libraries in Illinois would have to show they're following the American Library Association's Bill of Rights, which says libraries shouldn't ban books because people don't approve of its content or for political reasons. Or they could issue a statement saying they're not going to ban books. Otherwise, they won't be eligible for state grants the Secretary of State's office issues. What this bill does is it protects intellectual freedom. Lincoln Library in Springfield supports the bill, saying not much would change for them if this passes. Any acquisition of a material is not an endorsement of it at Lincoln Library. It's just our expression and commitment to um, intellectual freedom. So it doesn't change a lot for our library. We've always had that position. Some Republicans oppose the bill, arguing especially in schools, it should be up to parents to decide what reading material is best for their kids. The reality is nobody wants to ban books. The, the people that voted against this bill today were the individuals saying, we want to make sure that books are going to the right age level. The Secretary of State played a major role in working with lawmakers to propose this legislation since he serves as the state librarian. The bill passed out of the House today and now heads to the Senate. Reporting live in Springfield, I'm Theodora Kulavaris, WCIA 3, your local news leader. Theodora, thank you.